all of these cost about forty dollars total so i'm not sure you're gonna believe it these are all of the planners i just got at the thrift store for a total price of forty dollars maybe it was like 39.99 or something but pretty much let's take a look at them hang on let me put these over here oh well, let me just maybe get through it here all right pocket filofax 3.99 i can't believe this i think i actually bought one on one of the planner facebook pages for like 40 bucks or 80 bucks it was something ridiculous i'm looking at this it's like eh, it seems perfect this is what i had got in a tannish color and then there's always these little puckering things and the other one i had actually this has come off so it's kind of nice to have one that's kind of still functional so and it has all the pages still so that looks great so a big planner win here and i got this which you know sometimes you'll see these little marks and i'll just take a little bit of soapy water and wipe that off it has something for tickets it seems like some kind of travel bag this was I probably if i didn't have all of these planners i probably wouldn't have got this just by itself but i figured let me try this out but this is a um some kind of a travel book of some sort and it has all of these different secretarial pockets and some business pockets and something here and then this cute fascinating little thing that comes out for what it says traveler's checks i don't even know if you can get those anymore and then you can fold it to make a little wallet that looks cute and then you can put it back in here and then to keep it in place you can snap it and all these wallets here i actually already checked and then this set will fit one of my standard size traveler's notebooks and i don't even need to put a um string in it because if you have something like this where you take one of the uh, rubber bands and you keep these two together you can just put the back sleeve in and then it fits in perfectly and i've already tried that that's going to work out really well so i like this i bet if you had a weeks a weeks would fit in here really well um and then i think this was 5.99 which is kind of a lot for something like this at the thrift store but i figured why not just to get it this is beautiful this was 2.99 it is a journal it has a little lock on the side and you open it up and it's got this journal book in it and i haven't gone through all of the little writings in here but this is just going to be so much fun to write in like i don't know what that's about but it's very beautiful loving that now this one i had got mostly for the dividers and i actually had put some of these already in my uh one book july so I put some of the dividers here, but this was $2.99, day timer, with the seven rings. This is plastic, so it's not the greatest, but I think for keeping maybe even, um, maybe used sheets, because then I have the tabs here. This is from 2005, everything looks perfectly new. I'm not going to use this probably. There's also like an A through Z and some additional tabs in here that I took out so that I could use it for One Book July. So right now this will be mostly for storage. Then I got this guy who will be a little scrapbook notebook. It even came with all the pages, which is going to be amazing. So this was, that'll be a fun project to work on. This one was looking like it was completely new still. So this one was $2.99 and it has everything that is undated. So that's great because you can use it anytime. It's got a vertical layout, which is my favorite. That This is probably a little bit small, but I think what I'm going to try to do with this one is, so I am going to try, it's got a pocket here, secretarial pocket. I'm going to, um, because it's a zip, I think I'm going to try to make it into a little purse. So if I ever want to do a personal size six ring kind of format, I can just carry this with me. And I'm going to show in another video how I add uh, a handle to it. That's really simple. Oops, I'm just going to put these over on the side. 
Then this one, I'm gonna try to use it for my Hobonichi. I think this is kind of plastic, but it has a nice deep burgundy color, so I like how it looks. I'm gonna put a little notepad in here. There's a pocket here, but I'm gonna just cut this open. I can even do it right now. This is usually what I do when I'm trying to figure out how I'm gonna use something. It's like, I'll just take this and then cut it right down the side. And now I'm gonna have a little place where I can put my Hobonichi and then close it up. And this will almost look like a little purse. So I'm gonna try that out and have a video on that one. Now this one is a day timer, seven rings. So you could put Franklin Covey pages in here. It has got a pen, like a really huge pen loop. This, this guy here, you can put your notepad here. I'm going to again, because uh, I love the deep burgundy red color. This will need to be washed a little bit, but I'm going to do a video on just putting a handle on this one. And then that way I hopefully can use it as kind of a, a purse that I could put over my shoulder. So that's gonna be uh, probably the next video. Same type of thing. So zipper, but this one's a Franklin Covey. Oh, and this one costs $2.99. And this one was $1.99, which is amazing. So it is a classic size Franklin Covey. You just need to kind of wipe off the inside with a little soapy water. And then the last one is going to be this big three ring. I don't know what's the brand, but it has all of these, a zipper pocket here. It's got pen loops. It's got this ginormous one that will even fit my iPhone. Some places for business cards, ID, and then if you're familiar with the Monarch size Franklin Cubby, you can put that into a three ring like this, and then you can put a notepad here. So this is the biggest haul that I've ever got. I got one three ring, uh, eight and a half by 11 size. I've got two zippered seven ring ones. I got something that looks like it's gonna fit the Hobonichi. I've got a personal size. I've got this classic size that is a day to another day timer. This guy, journal, wallet size for uh, standard size traveler's notebook things, and the file effects. I, I cannot believe this, all for $4. And I sometimes buy full price traveler's notebooks that are like small little things for like almost $100. So this is, this is gonna be super fun to play with. All right, see you later, bye.